finished getting ready. I just put on some workout clothes because I'm gonna be going to the gym. I just finished my first online class that I had this morning. But recently I have been procrastinating doing like personal work stuff on my computer, like replying to emails, organizing my notion, planning YouTube stuff. There's just so much I've been putting off that I need myself to dedicate some time this morning to do. So I'm gonna go to a coffee shop to motivate me to actually get these things done. Because I'm telling you, I know for a fact that if I stay home, I'm gonna keep getting distracted. I'm gonna keep putting it off and never really get to it. It is currently 10 21 in the morning which is so pretty early so let's get going So I spent about an hour here at Starbucks. I got some stuff done, so much included organizing my Notion. And then recently, I've been looking into buying a new vlogging camera, which I bought this day. And then lastly, I redid my channel banner plus YouTube profile picture. As soon as I finished up here, I headed straight to the gym. Alright guys, every time I go to the gym and I tell myself I'm going to vlog, it ends up going horribly. Just know, this was my leg day. When I finished up, I headed straight back home and took a shower. out of the shower all right so i'm gonna start getting ready in a moment because i have some errands to run but before i got into that i quickly did want to thank mark for sponsoring today's video so one of the errands that i plan on running today is actually going out and shipping clothing that i sell online and poshmark is actually one of the apps that i use to help me sell that clothes online if you've been needing some help cleaning out your closet or even making some extra money let me tell you poshmark is the easiest way to do that also on poshmark you can find amazing deals and shop from thousands of brands up to 70 percent off retail prices there are luxury brands available at very affordable prices. Right now, before I leave, I'm going to be listing some stuff onto my Poshmark, so if you guys want to go shop my closet, my username is at Adela Dadal. On my Poshmark, I always list my clothing for $15 or less, and already, make sure to go download Poshmark. You can do so in the US, Canada, and India. I will also make sure to put a link at the top of my description for you guys to go and download Poshmark so that you can shop from my shop and your favorite brands. therapy moment, a little car therapy session moment. This is gonna be a long drive and I'm realizing that because I'm looking at my map and there's literally traffic and I am gonna rage. Okay, let's catch up. It's February. I'm proud of myself today. I feel like I got so much done and it's only like, what, 10 in the morning? I feel like I'm accomplished, which is good because I haven't been feeling that way lately. January, I told you guys this in my last video, was just not a good month for me. That reminds me, I've been having this theory that I feel like January is the test trial month. February is the real new year. For a lot of people, usually January is the better month because that's kind of when everyone's the most motivated, but that's just like not the case for me. These past few weeks, I feel like I've been falling out of my routine and I really need to get back into it. So that's kind of like what my goal is today. I'm trying to keep myself as occupied as possible today. I made a whole to-do list of everything I want myself to do. I just know that if I follow through with what I want myself to do, I'm going to be super proud of myself. It was a little hard for me this morning, not gonna lie, to get off my phone. A part of me wanted to keep scrolling, but I was like, no, put your phone down, get up, go brush your teeth, start getting ready for the day, and that just went so well for me. I actually have a class in an hour and a half from now, and so right now, before my class starts, I'm trying to use this window to go grocery shopping because there's literally no food at my house. So right now, we're gonna go do some grocery shopping. And hopefully that doesn't take you too long.
Okay, so it is currently 12.24. I just made myself some pizza. My class is gonna start now in like six minutes. I have literally been craving pizza so hard this past week that I just, I had to. I also got myself this yerba mate. Very delicious. I used to get these all the time. I've officially finished all of my schoolwork. I only had two classes today, so it wasn't too bad. So I actually forgot that today I had an appointment to go get my haircut, which is in like 30 minutes. I'm also going to go get my roots fixed. And I need to go do that because I have a trip that is coming up this weekend, which I'm so excited about. But before we head out, I do have some packages that I just got in the mail literally five minutes ago. Set Active. They're always sending me the cutest sets. This is literally perfect. Set Air. They sent me a bunch of traveling essentials. Literally going on a trip this weekend. Cute. We got a little deodorant, a sleep mask, jet lag mask, hand sanitizer, some cute set active socks, cute stickers, this little eye mask, ah, the cutest little toothbrush, and a face mask. But okay, let's talk about these sets. They sent me this matching brown one and then this matching gray one. Then next, I got sent this cute little birth date book, which is basically like this personalized astrology book. So if you wanted to learn more about your natal chart, it literally gives you all the information about it to help you better understand understand it. I got sent some tops from this small business on Instagram. It is called A Makes Clothing Leads. I know for a fact that when I wear these, I'm gonna feel like a fairy. Then the last package that I have here is from Native. They sent me some deodorants and then this like body wash thing. Okay, that was everything. It's funny. I feel like when you have an online shopping addiction, receiving packages feels like it's Christmas. But okay, we're gonna start heading out before it starts to get too dark outside because I hate driving at night. Like my driving skills are bad enough. Driving at night just feels 10 times scarier. So after my hair appointment, I was actually late to a dinner that I was supposed to go with friends, so I didn't vlog. I also did some shopping, and this was literally the only clip that I got. I'm back home now! So this is now the part of the day where we're gonna be having an intense editing session. It's 6 o'clock right now, and I'm most likely gonna have to finish editing around 11 or 12. Like, I'm gonna be stuck on my computer most likely for the next 5 to 6 hours. It sounds crazy, but this is very, like, normal for me. I spend a lot of time editing my videos, like, a lot of time. I enjoy it, so it's fine. I don't really mind. Right now though, I do want to take some time to clean my room a little bit because I made it my goal to take at least 15 minutes every single day to tidy my room so that at the end of the week, I don't have to clean as much. I'm in the middle of cleaning right now and I almost forgot to play my playlist. I'm literally cleaning in silence. I've been getting addicted to creating a playlist for every occasion. You guys need to go follow my Spotify. I've also been getting really into podcasts. Like I've been listening to a lot more because before I would only really listen to the Emma Chamberlain one. But some of my recent favorite podcasts are Note to Self, The Gary V Audio Experience, The Boss Babe Podcast, It's Emily and Life with Mariana and The Emma Chamberlain Anything Goes. Of course. You guys should definitely recommend some podcasts in the comments so i finished cleaning my room but i swear guys you guys have watched me clean my room a jigabillion times so we're just gonna skip forward here to my editing session So it is now 11.48 
as predicted. I technically finished editing sooner than I thought. I'm gonna get ready for bed now because I'm so dead. Another healthy habit that I've been trying to implement into my life is sleeping earlier. And I know that 12 isn't early, like most normal people probably sleep like at 10, but that is just impossible for me considering that my sleep schedule has consisted of me going to sleep at like 3 a.m. for the past few months. So like this is an improvement. I also have been trying to not use my phone before I go to sleep and instead like read a book because I feel like that's just a healthier way to fall asleep. Just not having a screen in your face, which has been life-changing. I love that for me. And oh, another one of my favorite healthy habits that I've also been doing lately is journaling. Guys, one thing I always hated about journaling was how it was always hard for me to stick to writing into a journal because I always wanted it to be perfect. This year, I decided to try something new, which was taking that expectation away. So now I just journal. I don't force myself to keep up with it every day. I literally just write in it when I want, but I'm pretty sure that the more I do it, eventually it'll be better. I, I don't know. I don't know if that made any sense. I'm just gonna go wash my face with some good old water and tuck myself to sleep. I'm done with myself. Okay. So that was the end of my day. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I missed you guys so much. If you don't have your post notifications on, what are you doing? I have a lot of exciting content coming up in the next weeks and you don't want to miss out. And if you haven't already, remember to download Poshmark. The link will be in my description.